pulled me over after I was already parked though, correct? And my vehicle was off? Yeah, we have video footage of you driving. To be accurate, you have to pull me over while I'm doing something. I gave you Obviously, you've been stopped before, so I'm well, just I, yeah, no, I, so I know my rights, and I know you can stop me on a pub. Do you have a license plate on the vehicle? Yeah, it's actually in the back window. Okay, that's tinted? Um, it comes factory. It's a Jeep. Jeep's come factory, a back window tent. How about this tent? Do you want to see my script? Yeah. Okay, it's in the back seat. So I'm not doing anything illegal. This is stock tip back here is what you're telling me? Um, no, I'm telling you the back windshield is where the plate is located. The plate doesn't go on the back windows, they go on the back windshield. Okay. From the outside, correct? Improper no. display and it's registration. Not, it's not improper, it's officer. Not, it's supposed to be, it's supposed to be on the back bumper. You want to read the plate? I can open the trunk so you can look. It says on the paper plate, bottom left so side of the window. Yes. Know, yep, it's a, you it. it's a brand new car. It's a brand new car. This darked out, you can't see it one bit. I just want to reemphasize the fact you couldn't see it at first. You did just state you were able to see it though. No, so it is I could legal. never see it. No, you just, I have it on video now. You Play said at back. first, at first you weren't able to see it. Play it back. I couldn't see it the whole time because the rest of the car. What if you took back with another video? And uh, we got some, another cop pullover video. And uh, this happened about two days ago. I'm about to release the video now because I was just thinking about it for a little bit. Because, I mean, I'm not going to lie, I didn't handle myself the best. I was kind of mad, and I took it out on them. But at the same time, what they did was not legal. Everyone has their own opinion, but uh, I'm going to run it down so you guys understand. And uh, let's get into it. All right, so pretty much I was driving. The cop was sitting right there. So I came here. You know, he always sits for the stop sign to like get people that don't stop. I made my full stop. I saw him sitting right there. I was like, whoop de doo you know. I'm chilling. I'm Gucci. I rolled my windows down so he knew, like, ain't nothing going on. And I was driving, bada bing, and then he was still sitting there. I was like, all right, nothing. Just cop driving by, another day, another thing. So I kept driving. You see, it's I'm still driving probably, like, 30 seconds down the road. And I look back in my rear mirror. He still hasn't left yet. He's still sitting there. So I'm like, all right, I'm good. So I keep going. I'm getting the gas. So I pull into this gas station right here to get gas. And I'm sitting in there. I'm parked for a sec. I open my door. I'm walking out to start pumping gas. And here comes a cop zooming in. No lights, nothing. So he was driving all the way down this road, probably 50, 60 miles per hour. And it's a 25, 30 mile road. Zooming with no lights on. He gets behind me, right there at the pump, and then turns his lights on. He turns the lights on right when he gets behind me. So I'm gonna play the video now, and you guys are gonna see. I was mad because he didn't pull me over on the roadway. I had nothing, I wasn't doing anything illegal. I was doing the speed limit. And he pretty much just wanted to pull me over to see what was going on with the car. It was no legit reason. But uh, yeah, let's get into it. Pulled me over after I was already parked though, correct? Yeah, and my vehicle was off? Yeah, we have video footage of you driving on the roadway. Okay, but you, you have your license and registration. You behind me. So correct. No, that's not accurate. Okay, for a pullover to be accurate, you have to pull me over while I'm doing something. The gun and a cup holder. Yep, I have a CPL. Okay. Okay. That's up to us. My that door's open. I was walking out of the car, you pulled okay. up after Do I was parked. you have your license and your CPL and your yep. registration and insurance? There's that. I'm just gonna run from the car, that's all. Alrighty, no worries. Here's my CPL officer. Do you have a license plate on the vehicle? Yeah, it's actually in the back window. Okay, that's tinted? Um, it comes factory, it's a Jeep. Jeep's come factory, a back window tent. How about this tent? Do you want to see my script? Yeah. Okay, it's in the back seat, if you don't mind me grabbing it. Okay. There's no other weapons in the car, but and I'm grabbing know, the... Uh, how to display a license plate through tinted windows? Yep, so it legally stays on the paper. I've gone to court multiple times. I have all my documents stating on the license plate, it's a temp tag. Okay. It says that it has to be displayed legally in the back left corner of the windshield. Oh, and once this again. Is a stock tent. So I'm not doing anything illegal. This is stock tip back here is what you're telling me? Um, no, I'm telling you the back windshield is where the plate is located. The plate doesn't go in the back windows, they go in the back windshield. Okay. So they are displayed so you know legally. that's why you get stopped every time because you have a license plate that's not observable from the outside, correct? Improper no. display of it's registration? Not, it's not improper, it's officer. Not, it's, supposed to be, it's literally supposed to be on the back bumper. You want to you wanna read the plate? I can open the trunk so you can look. It says on the paper plate. Bottom left so side of the window. Yes. It's yep. Plate. It's a brand new car. It. It's a brand new car. And these things do get stolen quite a bit. Yeah, I understand. So you can literally see these are all paperwork of cases that have been dismissed because it's proper. Here's my script. 
compares all the paperwork that's sent yeah, to the I know state. A script. Yep, and this is all the paperwork that's being sent to the state that's documented that I have to have tint for my eyes. Okay. So if you want to see this too, this is all legal paperwork from the DMV. Okay. Do you have your registration and insurance? Yep. Uh, I gotta reach in the back seat again. Okay. Any more weapons or just nope. that one? Nope, just that one. Alrighty. Alrighty. So here's this, my, the one that's effective on my phone. Okay. But you guys can pull up the policy number from the S and see that it's effective still. So you have to have the proof of insurance. Okay, I can stop it. On one second. Okay. I mean, like I said, I'm not gonna argue anymore. Yeah, I gave I'm you not, all my stuff. I'm not here to argue with you. I'm just, just simply asking. Yeah, I just. I, I want to see where you're coming from. Yeah, I just believe that if you had pulled me over on the roadway with my vehicle running on and pulled into a private pro private property, then yes, you could pull me over. But since I was already parked at my pump with my vehicle off, my door open, about to exit the vehicle, my door is open, my foot's open, you guys are stopping me on private property right now. We saw you back at 11. And you you saw me. You saw me, but you didn't pull me over back then. That's the big difference. Because we were in a parking lot. So you have to have gotten behind with your lights on. So but I now got, I'm already I out I got there. behind you as we're coming up. So I'm just letting you know okay, that we can sure. do this. Okay. okay. All right. I, and all I want to do is see your point of view. Yeah, yeah Obviously, course. you've been stopped before. Obviously, I mean, you've educated yourself somewhat. I mean, I know my rights. And like I said, I gave you all my paperwork. There's no reason for you guys to give me a ticket. I have everything documenting where my plate is. I have my tent prescription. Okay. I gave you everything. And I gave you my CPL, another, my license. Okay. And that's that's all perfect. What you do have to do that you didn't do is disclose, especially when you have a gun in the cup holder accessible to you, you have to disclose to me that you're a CPL holder. But I'm status. walking out of my vehicle. Okay. But I, I understand I understand that. Okay, I could have told you that right away. Yep. But so I was facing as this you way. In the CPL class, that's what you're supposed yep. to do. Okay. I was facing this way about to exit my vehicle. I'm not expecting you to be walking up to me right now. Well, you were expecting it. Not you really. had your phone recording already, getting out of the car. You knew you were expecting it. I record it. everything. So you're recording nonstop. I don't know what I can, I don't know. So you were expecting us to do that. That's what was happening. So you knew we were, we were going to make contact. I'm just going to gas. That's all so I had to say. That, that's I wasn't I, expecting you to make contact. No, I was not. Okay. So you stepping out of the car saying you have no right to pull me over while you're recording. You weren't expecting to see me. I do this for a living. I record. Okay. That's my profession. That's, that's fine. If I get out, my camera's starting right away. That's, that's what fine. I do. I'm not, I'm not here to jam you up or anything. I'm I just simply it. seeing your point of view. I get it. Okay. So okay. When, when we encounter things like this, I apologize. I, I for wonder that. why. I'll tell you that for not disclosing it right away, but I did tell you afterwards. Okay. So, so another thing, it may be factory tint on the back window. I know this isn't factory tint. No, this isn't. On the back window, you can't see that plate through there. So that's why you get stopped all the time. That's improper display of plate because if you can't see it through the window, I know it says on there. You technically can see it. It is tinted. I couldn't, I couldn't see it the whole time because the rest of the car is tinted. So that factory tint on the back. I couldn't see it the whole time because the rest of the car couldn't see it the whole time because the rest of the car... Alright, and then you guys heard that right there. He said he couldn't see my plate the whole time. My plate's back there. It's I have the rest of my car tin, but the back windshield is still stock. Back windshield and these two back windows come stock. Died from factory, so they're stock still. So he said he couldn't see it the whole time. Everyone can like perceive what he meant in different ways. But the way he was saying it was, I couldn't see it at first, but then I was able to see it once I got behind you. So not the whole time I couldn't see it, but I was eventually able to see it, is what he was getting at. So that means you could see it, so there's no point for the stop. He couldn't see it at first when I pulled out in front of him, but then he was able to see it, eventually. And that's how, I mean, that's how it is on the back windshield. You can't see it with the glare of the sun, but it's there, it's legal, you can see it. So he couldn't see it at first, or he couldn't see it the whole time, meaning the whole duration. But he was eventually able to see it then, is what he means. But I don't know. That's crazy. Let's get back into it. And there's light coming through these windows when they're norm, when they're yeah. factory. You can see that. I get okay. But, but like, with this darked out, you can't see it one bit. I just want to reemphasize the fact you couldn't see it at first. You did just state you were able to see it though. No. So it is I can legal. never see it. No, you just I have it on video now. You Play said at first, at first you weren't able to see it. Play it back. I couldn't see it the whole time because the rest of the car. So you I did never, say it. No. You play did. it back. You did say it. Play it back. It's live right now. So okay. When I save it, I can. Play it back so I can hear it. Yeah, I can have I have it. You're recording here, okay, too. That's cool. But you cannot see that. Okay. All right? And it's because of all these tents. All right? All right. Give us one second. All right, for sure. 
but I literally pulled Bill over for no reason. I literally was just getting gas. So you're gonna get two warnings today. All right. For the for the display of plate, because it may be a factory temp, and with all this, you cannot see that plate back there. And then the failure to disclose your CPL. If you if we did give you a ticket for that, it would go to a gun board and you may lose your CPL. So all we're right. not gonna do you like that. All right. All I'm doing is simply seeing where you're coming from. Maybe next time instead of hopping out when you're not expecting to see me with your phone recording, saying you have no right to stop me, maybe disclose your CPL first. Because then my partner comes up, you got a gun in your cup holder. Things go a little differently when there's yeah. guns involved and you're not telling me there's a CPL. Well, I vlog. That's what I do. I'm a YouTuber. So, for my profession, I'm vlogging. So, I'm getting out of my car vlogging me getting gas. Okay. So, you so are views are more important than disclosing a CPL? Well, in my opinion, I'm on private property, parked, getting out. You guys weren't behind me when my vehicle was already oh, off. So. so, I'm not going to argue anywhere. I, I understand your point. I understand A recommendation? Your point. Brush 100%. up on your laws a little bit? 100%. If you're going to be doing this, disclose you have a CPL. Because my partner sees a gun in your cup holder. Things could go differently. Yeah, yeah of and course. And you didn't disclose your Like CPL. I said, my, my foot's literally still out the door. Like, I was I was ready to go. I wasn't sounding like I, I know. You were ready to hop out while you were recording. I know. I, I was right here. 100%. So, all right? All right. Nope. Gotta get that thumbnail. Good thumbnail. God, it's another day, another day, not the day, but you know, your boy knows his laws. All right, so you guys saw the whole video. You let me know what you think. You think he was in the right, in the wrong to pull me over? Yeah, I should disclose my CPL from the beginning, but I was out of the car. He shouldn't have been able to stop me when I was getting out of my vehicle. It's not like I was on the road where he pulled me over. It was a really weird stop, but you guys let me know, and I'll see you in the next video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe.